So I need to netherrack a chest upgrader. Um, so netherrack chest. No, the, the netherrack is 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 yeah. With and then moving the stuff up. So I still need a chest upgrader, which um, needs a bit of wood, which I have. Um, I can't remember the way it works, so I'm just going to grab all the different metals, chuck it in, and then just see which one works. Normal chest to copper chest. So, copper chest. Do you go to gold chest? No. Do you go to silver chest? Because yeah, I know that by... Yes. To silver chest. Silver chest. Do you go to gold chest? No. Um, I think the silver chest might um, skip one or, or something like that. But, but to be honest, as you've seen, I mean, that there's a gold chest. How do I get the gold chest? I don't know. I don't know. It's not going to hurt to um, have a couple of these upgradey things and get multiple silver chests. There we go. Water, netherrack, and the supplies. Holy crap, okay. While I'm out of here, while I'm out here, Oh, I'm getting my house in order. I really am getting my house in order now. Feels good. You know, and you've, you know, I know that a lot of us would rather be playing games than say tidying. Um, and I suspect that a lot of you have probably been shouted at it once. I certainly did pay way back in the day. It's like, right, that's it, tidy your room, um, because it's a mess. Um. Probably with less laughter, more shaking of fist, of anger, or something like that, I don't know. Um, but uh, there is something decidedly satisfying about the result of having tidied. Maybe that's just me. It's one of those things. It's like going to the gym. You kind of, sometimes you really don't want to go. Sometimes you just go, oh, I can't be bothered, and it means leaving the house, and it's cold, and... I mean, I'm only going to be there like an hour and a half, and it's going to take me an hour of traveling to, you know, and you kind of almost work yourself, talk yourself out of it. Um, but then, you know, once you've gone, and you get going, you're like, oh, I'm so glad I came, raw because, the, you know, you, you, you're going for it, and, uh, and, you know, the benefit, the benefit is that water, I'm talking about bloody tidying and gym work, and I ended up getting completely distracted again. Oh, you wouldn't know who I was if I didn't get distracted periodically, would you? You'd be like, who is this person that sounds like Melek? It is not Melek. So we need all those enchanty books. Um, ugh, ugh. Ugh, let's just dump all that in there for now. Brown wool, feathers, glass bottles. Planky bits, buttons and sticks, tins. There we go. So it's sort of become an organics chest. Um, wow, I've got a lot of crap. Okay. Nearly there. Nearly there. We can start trans... I know it's part of the next trip, but I want the netherite now. There we go. That crucible's going to be all burny. I know that I can maybe replace... Yeah, because there's like a, a magical fire that produces light, and there's a magical fire that produces heat. There's like two of them, isn't there? That's quite cool. Um, Right, it's chest upgrading time. Pow! Pow! Okay, 
See, they look they look nicer already. Oh, look at the capacity. Oh. <laughs> it's good though, isn't it? I mean, the amount of stuff that I can store in these upgraded chests is ridiculous. Makes things all so much better. And now I need to produce an infinite water supply. Is that really necessary? Possibly not. Possibly just chuck a load of water. Yeah. Can't empty it again. It's alright. Does it need more water? It looks a bit empty. Oh! Uh, no, it didn't need more water. <laughs> <laughs> Don't wash away my crystals. Bye bye, water! Um. I wonder if aluminium torches get knocked off like normal torches. It would apparently not, or the stairs are angled in such a way that it doesn't happen like that. Right, so only needs the one. So netherrack, we need a little bit of netherrack. Just a little bit of netherrack makes the crucible boil, the crucible boil, the crucible boil. A little bit of water makes the... Oh, it really does boil. Cool. So now I have a Burny Cauldrony Crucible thing, which I'm going to break things down into their component parts. Sounds fun. Um, awesome. Okay, buildy things. You buildy things can go in there. Ah! One off button. What is that? Mechanics and Shizer. Yeah. Tin cans. Do I have anything organic on me? I know, I know, I know. Oh god. Hello. Tour. Put the can in there. Grab that. Chainsaw it. Oh yeah. That in there. Grab that. Put that in there. I need to make this roof higher up, that's for certain. Put a few bits in there. about right. That is about right. And the other thing I'm going to get while I'm down here are the other... Is it, is it, it's not this, it's V. It's Vis, isn't it? It's Vis crystals or something like that. And then I suppose let's just for now just leave it for these. As I try, ah, don't you cook these? You do cook them, don't you? They are for the cooking, yeah. Yeah, they are for the cooking. Um, I'm thinking. <coughs> the problem is with it with it being a splitter. Um. For the uh, for the iron, it, it kind of doesn't work quite so well. Um, it's a shame this thing's off now. It was draining power unnecessarily. Yeah, this definitely seems to be. That's getting quite full of stuff now. Oh, 
Okay, well that seems to be doing its thing. I'm just gonna truck a load in there and just make it do it. Yeah, you, you, you cook all that. Um, oh, there was something else I was gonna do now. Um, possibly not actually. I could be completely wrong. Yes, I'd already got those Vise shards. And the Vise shards are what I was after. Enough of this. It's always and you know what? Even if you know the mu where the music's from, bonus points. Um, maybe one bonus point. You only get one bonus point purely because you know I did a let's play of the game. Um, and I've just then obviously now given you a clue. So so definitely only only a uh, only one bonus point. But um, yeah, whenever I go in real life, whenever I go up or down spiral staircases, but you know like in old ruins, you know castles and stuff. Especially when they're made of stone. Always. Always. Not always, you know, hum the tune. But um, it's. I can't help myself but, uh, but, but give it a go, you know, in my head. It reminds me. Okay, right. Before I get completely and utterly distracted yet again by my, my mindless ramblings, I want to transmute some stuff. And I've got a lot of stuff just here. So a bucket full of water is quite good research. Just because it's got water in it. Now, I want to do crucibly things. We still don't know what that is. Um, but I want to transmute tin. Actually, let's um, let's be clever about this. We want to do iron transformation. Um. And copper transformation. Surely that's what we also want to do. We need paper. All the paper. All the paper. And then copper. Look at that. Straight away. Oh! We've got 100% that. Exchange. Exchange. That was the... Um, 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 what has exchange? What has exchange? What the hell had exchange? I thought I knew something had exchange. Well, obviously, I, I know I must have something because I've researched the other transmutation y things. Okay, okay, slowly does it. Slowly does it. There, silver. For some reason, silver has that property. Copper transmutation. Thought so. Uh, I'm actually going to read the recipe. Then I'm going to do this research. And that will probably then require silver again if it's the transmutation yet. Iron. Okay. So, is there any other transmutations? Well, let's do silver. It might well be silver transmutation. Yay! He uses a lot of bloody silver. Okay. Bada bing. We need more silver. So let's see what else I've got now. I've got a lot of these. Look at these. That's mental. So let's make tin. We need five vis, which I'm sure is the um, the magic energy. So I need to wave my wand probably. And we get three tin nuggets for three metal and some vitreous, the crystally stuff. Nice crystal gem transparent.
So three metal and one vitreous. Let's get the wand out. Okay, so let's not have the wand out just in case I end up doing something accidentally. Um, there's the crystally stuff. That's got more glass has got more crystal in it. And it's not gonna have any leftover swirly stuff. Um and then iron's got pure metal. So metal and that. So So it's three metal. Well that's got eight and one of those, so that's so if I dump how do I literally just throw it? God, you do. And then we hit it with a wand. Right click with a wand. Ooh! Ooh! Did! It made stuff! No water in there anymore. Cool! So we can make tin pretty damn easily. That's pretty cool. So what multiple of eight is divisible by three? Um, well that'd be twenty-four. And twenty-four oh, oh dear. Would then mean three of that, which is no good. So forty-eight of that, six of that. So if I put um, eight bars and four glass, I believe that should in theory do it. I believe that would kind of, yeah, because then there'd be eight lots of crystal and then there'd be, oh no, that doesn't work, three lots of, oh, I don't know. Just don't want to waste the water. Who cares about the sodding water? Awesome. Okay, I'm just making ten here. Now this is fun stuff. And will this? It's a shame that doesn't. Oh, stop it. Okay. Oh, it it wasn't actually bubbling at that point, of course. Yeah, it's got to wait for the water to bubble. Ta -da. This is good. So now I've got 24 tin. I then can make sweet, sweet tin. Not massive amounts of tin, in fact actually hardly any, but it's still nevertheless, out of a bit of glass and iron, I can now create tin. That cannot be a bad thing. Let's get the water bubbling again. So I do need an infinite supply of water somewhere. In here, preferably. A pool here. Is a pool? I could have a pool. But that would not. That would be a little dangerous, you know. Um. What would probably be better is having a pool in here. That would actually be quite cool. Let's not squeeze past these sodding crystals, though. <laughs> yes, the crystals look cool. They're a little bit awkward to get around. Really, really are. <coughs> but yeah, in that far corner, might well. Ah, well, that's a bit not good, is it? I'm gonna cough there. Oh, hang on. Okay. I could 
I feel that that one was going to be a quite a hearty cough, so I thought I'll uh, I'll suppress that one for you and uh, and uh, and release it another way. It's not not great, but I could have be like a basin. Does that make sense? Yeah, because it's a round tower, so of course it can't have it quite there. But I could probably have it just there. Okay, let me please let this still work. Oh, look at that. And I don't quite need that much space for a basin of water. You know, I'm not a, not a fool, but well, I sometimes I'm a fool. There we go. Now we have kind of actually kind of works quite well. See, sometimes accidents like that—that's that, that's like an accidental kind of thing. Um, accidental kind of thing. Sometimes they can work out for the best. Ah, you're supposed to keep paper on you at all times, aren't you, in order to facilitate this. Cover is. There we go. Whenever you're doing stuff in here, you can sometimes make discoveries, can't you? At least that's what it said. Why well, I've got quite so many buckets, but okay. Well. Yeah, I suppose the only other thing I really need to do is try and figure out what the hell that is. Um, and that, because these are discoveries. I mean, a hell of a lot. That is quite cool. So what we need to do is <coughs> complete that probably then complete this, which will then unlock that, which will then unlock this, and then we've got lumps of, like, ham, <laughs> or wands, or, or different styles of racket for various sports. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping on ham, because ham, you can never have too much ham. Um, my doctor keeps telling me, yes, yes, you can, Melek. He calls me Melek as well. Um, and, <laughs> no, you need to cut out your ham. And I'm like, no, no, you, you misunderstand. I need more ham. Um, so I'm hoping those are hams. They look like. Or possibly wands. I'm, I'm hoping on hams. Lots of ham. What is that as well? It's like a... Well, that's a magical detail. I'm just thinking, what could that have possibly be? I have no cl Oh, I want to research. Right. What have I... Yeah, I want to research that book, don't I? Oh, well, look at that. Brown wool has got some serious components to it. Right, there's lots of things we've got lots of. So let's just do some random research. Do you know what I mean? Let's just do it. There we go. Because it's not like we can come up with stuff we've already researched. Okay, nothing happening with the rubber. 